You're watching AmericanOutdoors.net. Our chickens free range our property during the day. Now, <clears throat> around here this time of year, temperatures are dropping between the low 20s to the mid teens. Now, they have a heated water bowl inside their coop, uh, but it's important for us to keep several pails of water outside for them during the day. And freezing has become an issue. So I went online and I did a little homework, found some, uh, some real easy projects that have been done before, and I thought I'd show this one with you. It's very simple, it takes four items, an old tire, a livestock feeding dish, uh, some old insulation, and a rubber ball. So <clears throat> this so far has worked for us pretty well, and uh, I'm going to show you what we do. Okay, so the first thing we have here is our tire. It doesn't have to be brand new, it can have holes in it. Uh, this one's actually got water from uh, spillage and, and just rain getting inside of it. This one is a 16 inch tire. Second is the insulation. Now this is just some uh, bubble wrap style packing material, still got the air in it. You could use Walmart bags, you could use a shower curtain. What, you, what is important is that you fill the cavity, uh, that you fill up the air space in the tire um, to sort of insulate the base of your, of your bucket. You just want to fill this up uh, as tightly as you can. Just kind of pack it to fill up the gaps. Okay, <clears throat> now I've seen online where some people have put a a rock or a piece of wood on the on the ground below it to set the bowl on and you can do that just to keep it off of the frozen ground. Now this pail is just something I picked up at the local farm store. Uh, it's for livestock. It's just a rubber uh, pail. Uh, they sold these in 14 and 15 inch. I got the 15 to try and match it up to the tire so it would slip in fairly easily. I've seen a few videos where uh, one gentleman was using a bucket um, and he used spray foam insulation around the outside. Uh, it did not work for him. Um, my intent here was to get as, as close to a seal, as tight as a seal as I could with this, um, just to keep as much of, uh, of the outside elements out as possible. So, and then finally, I just take a pail and I'll fill it. Now as I'm adding water, the weight is going to push this pail down, this uh, black rubber pail, so it will slowly depress into the tire and form a little bit of a tighter seal, I guess. And the last thing I do is just drop this in. And the reason I put this uh, ball in there is uh, just to keep the water moving. Um, to just agitate it a little bit so if there's any kind of breeze uh, even when the chickens will come up here and peck the water a little bit it'll move this around and it'll help to uh, keep it from freezing now this isn't foolproof um, I can tell you right now the chickens they like getting up on the black tire because on a day like this when the Sun is out it does warm the tire a little bit and uh, I think they prefer that over the ground the black also helps to heat the the water too when, when the sun hits it. Um, it's not foolproof. Um, it will freeze. I'm positive of that. It hasn't done it yet. We've only been doing this for a few weeks. Uh, I don't know that this is going to be 100% a surefire method for eliminating ice in their water. In fact, I'm, I'm sure it won't. 
but it will also save me the trouble of coming out here every day and breaking this loose and refilling it only to have it freeze again in a couple hours. So again, this is really simple. You know, if you don't have a tire uh, on your property, you can probably drive down the road and find one in the ditch. Uh, it's not hard to find these things. I've probably got uh, 10 to $12 invested. Uh, this was actually the dog's chew toy. Um, I think I paid about 10 bucks for the pail and the packing material already came uh, with some other stuff we bought. So give it a shot, uh, you know, with a little investment here. You don't have to run extension cords into the uh, snow or the ice uh, and it might save you having to get out, you know, when the weather is, uh, or when you're not home uh, and having to worry about uh, whether your, your uh, chickens have anything to drink. <music>